Hello. Welcome back to Trauma Center Second Opinion. I'm still alone. I'm Tack. Um, so last time we saved a dude with, uh, wait. I think last time, last time we operated on a bomb, we saw some storyline, we went to Africa and operated on a guy on the plane, and now Deserted Village. I Wow, did we really go through four episodes last time? Getting shit done, taking care of business, I guess. Okay. Rubora! We're in Africa. Remains of Rubora, Zimbabwe. We're finally here, the sky's so clear. Mm, breathing that air. Ellipses. And it's deserted. I think we're looking at the results of a guilt outbreak. Oh, I wish you weren't so far away from home. Hey, don't talk like that. Over here. Who's that? Nice to finally meet you, Dr. Styles. Oh, Director Miller, sir. This is Langston Miller from WC's Europe. Right, he's the one who sent you to this mission. I was getting worried. You're a little late. You see, one of our coordinators is sick, and we don't know exactly where the research lab is. There's been a lot to worry about. Sir, I have an update. We searched for sectors B2 through 4, but we cannot locate the target. Hmm, in that case, expand your search into C areas as well. Yes, sir! The jungle makes a bird's eye search impossible. We tried to narrow it down back home, but we have a lot of ground to cover still. It must be frustrating. I have a bad feeling about this. Ha! Ah, Star Wars! You may join the search as well. Report back if you manage to find anything. This is a map of the area. We sent teams out here and here. What kind of map is this? I can't make any out any landmarks or anything. Well, let's get started, I guess. We're gonna operate on the map. Six long hours later. Are you alright, miss? I'm glad we can drive, but this jeep sure is a bumpy ride. Well, there aren't any roads in this area, at least, but at least we're not in the jungle. It's been a long road. Let's head back to camp for a breather. I didn't mean... So how to stop the jeep? There's someone in that house. He's a little kid. I thought they said this area was abandoned. One hour after that... The boy answers to Reuben, we think. Nice to meet you, Reuben. Yeah. What was he doing in there? We think he used to live there. His family actually lives not far from here. Shouldn't we take him home? Perhaps, but the boy seems to know the location of the research lab. Apparently his brother worked there, and Reuben got to tag along once or twice. He's more of a lead than we found out here thus far, don't you agree? Hey, It's as good a plan as any. Thank you, Ruben. Yeah. Uh-oh. Sad music. <laughs> Abandoned Delphi Research Lab. As we thought, it's completely vacant. What exactly are we looking for? Let me take some samples from the walls and floor just in case. Thank you, young lady. We'll need to undergo decontamination procedures after this, but hopefully we'll find something to make it worthwhile. This is no place for a trial, I'm afraid. Could you wait outside? Eh. That's a good lad. <sighs> Cross your fingers, yes? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Pandora's box. If you know what I mean. Pandora's box. Hmm. After all that, we still haven't learned anything about Delphi. The African guilt victims are being transferred to QCC Europe, right? Hopefully that will lead to something. Uh, yeah, but this was also tiring. Director Miller is late. I wonder who he was on the bleh. Dr. Stiles. What is it? The boy, Ruben's been infected by guilt. What? How? Terrible reaction positive, unknown infection detected. Extreme care is necessary when, during treatment. Most car results just came back. You test positive for guilt. Spectral analysis indicates that this is a different strain. An unknown guilt. We found an abnormality. We found an abnormality near his pancreas, but that's all. His vitals are dropping quickly. If we tried to reach a hospital, he'd probably die on the way. I think we should open up and do what we can, but it's your call, Dr. Styles. I understand, we can't just stand here and watch him die. Let's begin. I'll do my best. Do 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 do. Do do. 
time for operating time. Yeah, I'm good. Oh, yay, I forgot about this. What is it, Dr. Mary Stars? I think that membrane is responsible for the disease, and everyone covered by that membrane will slowly be petrified. We need to detach it immediately, try using the forceps. Hold on, you won't be able to detach it using that way. Don't you see the thorns? They're fastening the membrane to this organ. I think you're right. If you can remove all three forms on one segment, excision may be possible. That's quite quick thinking, Angie. You should consider looking into Caduceus Europe. Anyways, try pulling the thorn out with your full steps. I did it! Okay, it's out. Now try removing the thorns. Okay. I did it. Okay. Can you tell? A while ago, our country tried using similar technology to fight the cancerous tissue. Which shards which vibrate at high frequencies to stabilize the cancer for easy removal. It creates a hard membrane exactly like this one. This strain of guilt seems to be modeled after our treatment. Those thorns are releasing high frequency waves to essentially petrify his organs. Dr. Styles, we need to try removing them all at once. There must be some pattern to it. Keep an eye on the membrane. I guess I'll just go really fast. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Shit. There, it's all dead now. Shit. Proceed as normal. Okay. Shit. No. Ugh, god damn it. Shit! I got it. I got it. I got it. I got it. Is negative. I'm a winner. Uh, we were trying to create a treatment for cancer using high frequency vibrations, but there were complications. Our treatment couldn't differentiate between cancerous cells and healthy tissue, so it simply attacked them both. We wanted a way to help people, but we found a way to kill them instead. And apparently Delphi found out about it, that's what I meant. I'm gonna close up the patient. The treatment should be fine now. Oh shit. That was a bad stitch up. Come on. Nice work, Dr. Yeah, I'm the best. Look at all that. I'm a boom specialist. Uh, I want to be the very best though. Try not to move, okay, Ruben? You're going to be alright. Your mother's waiting like, just over there, so you'll be able to see her soon, okay? Dr. Miller might be able to send him back to England for further treatment. Maybe we should ask him. No, there's a Red Cross outpost in the next town over. I think it's best to keep this treatment local to avoid any complications. Yeah gift for us, but isn't this your book? Can we accept this type of style like he wants us to, I think? Huh, wait, this isn't a book. It's a file folder. It's in some kind of code, but yeah, read this part. Guilt. Burn this and give it to him. Thank you, Ruben. This is gonna save a lot of people. Yay! Dr. Styles. There you are. Director Miller, we have good news. Ruben gave us this. That can wait. We just received an urban telegram from America. Urgent, I wonder, huh? No way. What's wrong? Dr. DeSalle from Hope Hospital has just submitted to Caduceus USA. Caduceus, don't tell me he... Dr. DeSalle has been infected by a new strain of guilt. Oh no. Okay. 9.20. Let's see. Let's see, I did that one. I did that one. Well... I get. Might as well, huh? Yeah, let's do this. Pursuit. Mountain Pass. He's still following us. I thought we'd be able to lose him on this mountain road. He did come all the way from Japan, did Would you want to leave empty handed? Damn, reporters will do anything for a scoop. He probably wants to build his career on the remains of the Devil Doctor. Isn't it often? 
It isn't often the Japanese medical board expels a doctor for having magical powers, or maybe he just wants to get under that lab coat of yours and start some rumors of his own. You're disgusting. What makes you think it's me he's after anyway? If he stumbled on your organization, they have a presence in Japan, don't they? Considering all your activity lately, if anybody had found out about this, I'd know. If it's alright with you, I believe the situation calls for a little more speed. Are you sure he's a reporter? He could be working for the government. The FBI wouldn't be so obvious. It's so clear he does not no idea what he's doing. I've had training, but he's going to get himself killed if he keeps driving like that. Look out! There's a curve ahead. I know that. Damn it. That idiot ran right into the wall. Go back. You don't think you're gonna save him, do you? It's his own fault that's happened. Besides, pulling him out of that rev would be a pain in the ass. And how do you think his newspaper will treat the story if he dies? We're already in enough trouble as it is. Doctors, this would be a lot easier if you didn't have a conscience. I'm getting the hell out of here if he's bothered to black tag, understand? An external trauma and lacerations have occurred. There may be an abnormality in a patient's abdomen. Visibility is part of resources and further right here. It's too dark to see. We need to get him over in front of our headlights. You want me pull him out of the wreckage? No good, his leg is stuck. Guess I don't have a choice, so I'll have to treat him here. Can you even do that? I wish he was in a better position, but that shouldn't cause too many problems. If you have any suggestions about getting some light over here, I'm all ears. I think we're in trouble. Crash right out the tunnel's electrical system. With him on that side of the wreck, my headlights won't be able to do much either. Necessity is the mother of invention. Penlight, you've got to be kidding. Nope, and you're going to be holding it. Just shine it where I tell you, okay? Most of the trauma is here. I don't like the looks of his abdomen either. <sighs> Tonight's ab abdominal surgery will have two objectives. Extract infernal objects through training lacerations, and of course, don't fuck up. Given the situation, that's all about all we can do here for him. May as well get started! Oh, fuck me. This is gonna be shit. Here goes. Well, these are certainly less than ideal circumstances. I need to confirm the patient's condition first, but I guess that's what we do with pen light. Let there be light. I need to investigate this infected area. Confirm the infected area. Okay. Uh, right. Oh shit. Well, can I? Please? Can I pick anything else than this fucking assistant? What do you mean? Okay. Thank you. Okay. Focus. Shit. Fuck. Next. There we go. Stabilizing. I'll need to take another look around. Oh, here we are. Oh, that's not good. What are you doing? I need that light. I didn't. It was me. I think the batteries may have died. Batteries, damn it. This is a bad idea. Look, we have to get lost. There has to be something we can use around here. Wait, what about this? It's a camera. Oh, the flash. Poor bad. That's like he's a reporter. Look for the flash from the last one. Oh, fuck. Okay. Yeah, I know. I did it! I did it! I'm the best surgeon ever! Motherfucker. Okay. Oh look, the lights came on. Yeah, look at that, cool. That's it. Enough call for a rescue team. Hey, you weren't half as bad as assistant. No, I don't intend to make a habit of it. Let's get out of here. The last thing we need to do right now is play 20 questions. 
Yeah, let me drive, that put me in a good mood. Yeah, best. Best fucking surgeon ever. Okay. Uh, next time, hope under attack. Next time. Next time. Thank you for watching.